Autodesk Inventor 2017.3 release delivers updates and enhancements based on your feedback from Inventor Ideas. Let's take a look at some of those updates as well as other general enhancements. One of the first things you'll notice is you can easily restart the measure command by clicking in the graphics window. This allows you to quickly do consecutive measurements anywhere in your design. In dual unit with foot architectural settings is now available for measuring distances, loops, and areas. You can now use a crossing window to select multiple closed profiles when creating certain features, such as revolves, fillets, chamfers, sweeps, and coils. Select tangencies is now available within the project geometry command. This allows you to quickly select all tangent edges with fewer clicks. Projected sketch references are now maintained after you redefine your sketch. When you redefine your sketch plane, the associativity is maintained. This applies to projected geometry, projected loops, cut edges, and even cross part references. You can now convert sketch text from parts, assemblies, and drawings to sketch geometry, essentially lines and arcs, to create text engravings for laser etching. There's now separate settings for part and assembly sketch look at behavior when creating or editing your sketches. New options in the interference analysis dialog box allow you to treat subassemblies as components, treat subassemblies as a single component, and ignore interferences within a subassembly. Mismatched threads display the specific type of interference in a tooltip for four different interference types. Our 3D PDF export is significantly faster and now supports view representation color overrides. And finally, you can now create your own guided tutorials to share with anyone publicly or privately. And thanks again for all your feedback on Inventor Ideas. Keep these ideas coming and we'll make Inventor better with every release.